Okay, this problem asks us to graph the image of rectangle ABCD after a dilation with the origin as its center and a scale factor of 2. Okay, so it's telling us we're going to graph ABCD dilation, which remember is a type of transformation. Dilations can either make an image bigger, which we call an enlargement, or make an image smaller, which we call a reduction. They are both dilations. Okay, different types of transformation is a dilation. Enlargements do that, they make things bigger, and reductions make things smaller. Now think about it. we have a scale factor of two, which means we're gonna make everything twice as big. Okay, so our image of rectangle ABCD is should end up being twice the size of the one we have here if we do things just right. Okay, because our scale factor is two. Anytime we have a scale factor greater than one, the type of dilation we're doing would be an enlargement. We're going to make something bigger because, again, our scale factor is greater than 1. If we have a scale factor less than 1, then we're talking about making a reduction, making something smaller. Okay, but this asks us to use uh, a scale factor of 2. Now, algebraically, what would that look like? Well, if we're making everything twice as big, our coordinates x and y that we have right now on A, B, C, D, well, by making them twice as big, wouldn't it become 2 times x and 2 times y? There's the algebraic representation of this dilation. Okay? The scale factor, basically, you plug in in front of your x and your y. So, for instance, if I said to give this a scale factor of one-half, then we would say xy becomes one-half x, one-half y. Okay, and then the way we'll find the vertices of the image is by applying our rule. We're going to multiply our x and y coordinates by two. So, if you notice, uh, vertex A on our pre-image, or our original, a has coordinates of 2, 6. So A has coordinates of 2, 6. And when we apply our rule, well, 2 times 2 is 4. So A prime, excuse me, A prime will have coordinates of 4, 12. Vertex B had coordinates 4, 6. And those will become B prime will have coordinates of 8, 12. Vertex C had coordinates of 2, 2. Multiply both of them by 2, and they will become C prime will have coordinates 4, 4. And lastly, vertex D which had coordinates of 4, 2. Apply your rule, 2 times 4, d prime has coordinates of 8 and 4. So now we can go ahead and graph the image of rectangle ABCD prime. Let's take a look. So A prime, 4, 12. When x is 4, y is 12, there's where we find point A prime. And when x is 8, y is 12 is where we'll find vertex B prime. When x is 4, y is 4 is where we'll find C prime. And when x is 8, y is 4 is where we have D prime. And sure enough, when we sketch the image of rectangle ABCD after a dilation with a scale factor of 2, we end up with a rectangle about twice the size of our original, which is what we were looking for. So that is how you would show a dilation algebraically. And again, make sure you uh, ask for the coordinates of your vertices of the image, that you actually label them and write them in correctly.